Python the programming language, what is it? I am Parth Arya and I will get you started on your journey of coding with Python. Python is used all over the world, even by companies like Google, Spotify, Netflix. Why is it so famous? Well, first of all, it is very easy to pick up. You can learn Python right now too, and I will teach you. And it is very important and it has many, many applications. You can make so many programs with Python. Whatever you can think of in coding, you can make with Python. First of all, you would need to download Python and install it to your computer. And you can do that using the link in the description below. You can download the newest version of Python for whatever system you're using. Now, when you've downloaded and installed Python to your computer, this is the screen that will open when you open the IDLE shell, which is which stands for Integrated Development Environment. This is just the place where you will write your code. Now, the first program that we write in every programming language is called a Hello World program. And I will show you how you can do that. So you print Hello World. What you're doing here is writing the print statement, which is used to display output to the user. Notice how it gets colored in purple. And hello world is whatever we want to print to the screen and it is colored in green. So Python colors all things differently. We will learn that too later. And you also need to put parentheses or brackets around our, your uh, piece of code. So when I press enter, you can see that hello world, whatever I wrote here is printed to the screen. Now, of course, here our, our program is not getting saved and we need to save programs because we will need to use them again. And you can do that by going to file and new file or clicking control plus N and this untitled file opens here. I can write the same thing. Hello world. And now notice that when I go to file, it gives me the option of saving it by using control S. So all your normal shortcut keys would work with Python too. Now, when I go to save, my file manager opens and I get the option of saving my file wherever I want. Now I could print, I could save it in the Python directory where my Python is located to program itself. And I could make a folder called my files and give the word, give the name hello world. So now notice that my file is saved. When I press run, run module, which just means that I want to run my code. I want to use it. So when I press run, run module, this, this shows up and you can see that hello world is printed just like it was here and we could print whatever we want. Now notice this line, this just gives you the location of your file, right? So Python 3.8, my files, hello world.py, which is the name of my file. Now I could go back and I could also print, how do you do? And control S and I could press F5 to run. And you can see that hello world, how do you do is printed. It's, it's as simple as that. And you could do so much more with Python and I will tell you how you can. I will teach you about operators, variables, if statements, loops, lists, tuples, dictionaries. And I will also tell you what you can do on your own and how you can learn more on your own. Because as programmers, your duty is not to just code. It is to think. Thinking like a programmer is very important in programming as well as real life. It helps you think efficiently, it helps you think logically and helps you solve so many problems. That is why I pursue it and that is why millions of people around the world pursue it. And I hope you enjoyed this video. That is the end. I hope you understood how to write a basic Hello World program and I hope you're interested in Python. I have also written a book on Python which is linked in the description below on Amazon and you can read that if you want to know about python and i will cover all topics in video format as well so hope you enjoyed thank you so much